Northrop Grumman B-21 Raider, the world's first sixth-generation aircraft. What is new with this aircraft? What can this bomber really do? Let's see in this video. B-21 is a long-range stealth intercontinental strategic bomber able to deliver a mix of conventional and nuclear ordnance. This is meant to complement and eventually replace the aging bombers of the U.S. Air Force such as the B-2 Spirit. More importantly, this is also meant to deter any possible threats from China and Russia considering that China has accelerated its target to have made 1,500 nuclear weapons by 2035. In addition, China's hypersonic, cyber warfare, and space capabilities have drastically improved which could pose a problem in the future. The B-21 Raider is named in honor of the Doolittle Raiders during World War II when 80 airmen, led by Lt. Col. James Jimmy Doolittle and 16 B-25 Mitchell medium bombers, set off on a mission to retaliate after Japan attacked Pearl Harbor. Role The B-21's main role is to penetrate enemy air defenses and reach targets anywhere in the world without being detected even by the most sophisticated air defense systems. This is something that cannot be done by the U.S. Air Force's B-1, B-52, and to a small degree, the B-2 Spirit. Not only can the B-21 be used as a bomber, it is also designed as the lead component of a larger family of systems that will deliver intelligence, surveillance and reconnaissance, electronic attack and multi-domain networking capabilities. Technology According to Northrop, B-21 is extremely more advanced compared to B-2 because technology has evolved so much in terms of computing since 1989. The B-21 has an open architecture, allowing it to be upgraded rapidly without undergoing block upgrades unlike the earlier generation of aircrafts. New technology, capabilities, and weapons will be immediately integrated. This will make sure that the B-21 radar can readily keep up with whatever threat that will emerge in the future. The head of the program stated that the B-21 shares the same technology with the next generation air dominance fighter, which is currently under development at the time of the creation of this video. Design In terms of design, the B-21 looks similar to the B-2, but there are also notable differences. The sawtooth pattern in B-2's tail and engine inlets are no longer present in B-21. The B-21's engine inlets are more recessed and are curved forming an eye shape compared to the B-2's which are more pronounced and are square shaped. Stealth since stealth is the B-21's defining feature, it was designed by engineers to penetrate the enemy's air defenses without being detected. The B-21 speed is intentionally set to stay subsonic in order for its infrared and acoustic signature to be lowered. The engines are also embedded into the wings to keep it stealthy. Not only that, the aircraft is covered by advanced coating materials which absorb radar waves therefore reducing the radar wave reflection back to the source. According to Northrop, the B-21 is stealthier than the B-2. If B-2 has a radar cross-section comparable to a tennis ball, then it is expected that the B-21 has much smaller RCS since it is smaller than B-2. The U.S. Air Force officials describe B-21 as an extremely low observable design as opposed to the very low observable F-22 and F-35. If our adjectives are right, then this bomber is stealthier than the F-22 and F-35, but maybe by a small fraction of difference only. Crew This bomber can be optionally operated by two crews, but since this is a very advanced aircraft, it can be also unmanned, meaning it can fly without crews, maybe for missions which are highly risky. Specifications Currently, Northrop Grumman has not yet released any information about the B-21 specifications as they are classified 
but since this is smaller than the B2, which has 50,000 pounds payload capacity, it is estimated to have a payload of 30,000 pounds. According to aerospace experts, this bomber will use two to four Pratt & Whitney F-135 engines, which can generate a max thrust of 28,000 pounds of force without afterburner and 46,000 pounds of force with afterburner. These engines are currently used by the F-35s. Armaments Its armaments will likely be the same as the B-2's armaments, such as the B-61 nuclear gravity bomb, GBU-57 massive ordnance penetrator, and the new AGM-181 long-range standoff missile. Price The price of one B-21 considering the current worth of dollars in 2022 is $692 million. This is less than half the price of a B-2, including the development. Just like any other planes, this price is expected to go down if more B-21s are produced. USAF is expecting to order more than 100 of B-21s. It is hoped that the B-21 will not suffer the same problem like the B-2, wherein, initially, 100 B-2s were ordered but only 21 were built primarily because it was expensive and so was its maintenance. Maintenance According to Northrop, B-21 is more durable and the materials used require less maintenance, which would keep operations cost and downtime to a minimum. The B-21's cost per flight hour is expected to be half of the B-22's, which is $150,741. Unlike the B-2, which is derisively called the Hangar Queen, because it needs a specialized temperature-controlled hangar, according to Northrop, the B-21 will be placed under a shelter where other normal planes are put. This means that its maintenance will be cheaper than the B-2. Operation the B-21 will be operating under the Global Strike Command of the USAF. Its preferred bases are the following. Its expected official flight will be next year, 2023. And this is the most advanced and modern tank that the U.S. plans to buy in the future. <laughs>